Hello everybody, and welcome to the online f battle between King Gustav the Fourth and Hitman. This is the final of the uh, Dimitri Intraclan tournament, and it's the second attempt because the first one ended quite. Uh, drastically when they glitched out on me. Save replay didn't save, so uh, I'm recording this live. But this is the final, once again. Right, Hitman5698. Quick look at his troops. Bo Ashigaru at the front, it seems. Just behind we have the Katana Samurai. Another l another row of Katana Samurai there. Some Matchlock Warrior Monks. He's a General's Bodyguard. And some uh, Yari Cavalry. And King Gustav's forces. The bows at the front. Cavalry on the right side. Cavalry on the left. No Dutchy Samurai. Katanas. Katanas. Lots of more Katanas. Sixteen players entered the tournament for the course of yesterday. We whittled down to two. And here they are. King Gustav vs. Hitman. May the best man win. Bit of a standoff here. King Gustav's taking his horses down the right hand side. The Yari Cavalry's. Where are they going? Oh, they're going into the woods, it seems. And uh, Hitman's horses also lined up on the opposite side of the map here, as if they're about to fight. Huh. Some movements over here. Our hidden units have been discovered, my lord! The bulls are moving forward, it seems. We're gonna have a skirmish. Oh! Some arrows. Oh, the horses! They're gliding! Oh my god, this is a much faster pace than the first battle! Oh, Hitman's units here, his horses are suffering losses! Holy smokes! They got eliminated quite quickly! It appears that Gustav has got the upper hand in the Battle of the Cavalry here, and he's now Reforming his troops, it seems, as arrows fire in from Hitman's side. But it's uh, an exchange of blows now as fire arrows, Gustav's missile troops, fire arrows! Fire, fire arrows indeed. Fiery death relived once again here in Shogun 2. On fire! Arrows being fired from both sides here. Which which set of archers will gain the upper hand? Oh, 
Oh, hit man pulling his missile, uh, his missile, his infantry troops back out of harm's way. Not a bad decision. Up, oh, the horse is moving forward. Okay, okay, here we go. The archers have been targeted now by the horses. It's good night. Oh no, they're pulling out. Pulling away, they are. But these archers are wavering. It seems to me that with the combination of missile, fire, fire arrows, and his cavalry, Gustav has pretty much worn away Hitman's missile line. So the uh, skirmish, early skirmish stage, seems to have been won by King Gustav and his men. Can Hitman bounce back from such a blow? And also Gustav's horses. They're manoeuvring themselves behind Hitman's army. This cannot be good. No doubt they will play a, play a part in the not too distant future. As Hitman moves his men forward, his infantry are moving forward. This surely is now the crux of the battle. As Gustav fires his missile troops. His troops fire their arrows into the ranks of the infantry as they march forward. We are no doubt seconds away from hand-to-hand -hand combat for the first time in this online battle. Here they come! Yes, there we go! Steel on steel as the infantry tr troops collide with both armies. Both armies troops colliding here. Missile fire still firing on in. And let's not forget Gustav's Cavalry that found themselves behind the lines, no doubt here to cause devastation and break the lines of the infantry. Hitman's general still running around on here. Gustav's. Gustav's general, we can hear the horn blowing. No doubt rallying his troops as he runs down past the lines of infantry. More horns, more horns are sounding. Oh, this battle is turning now. We've got wavering troops on Hitman's side. Hitman is in danger of losing this now. And here come the, the cavalry. Oh, and men are flying. Men are flying here. Gustav's horses that found themselves behind Hitman's lines coming into play as we thought they would. This battle is pretty much over now. Everybody's routing. Congratulations to King Gustav. The first intra clan knockout tournament has been won by King Gustav. But congratulations to both guys that got to the final. And congratulations also to Hammer Force, who set this tournament up, and I have to say it was a success. 16 participants, and uh, every match was played with good spirit, but the winner is King Gustav, so congratulations, see you soon.